And students in a handful of districts around the metro take a school-issued laptop home with them every day. Our Brenda Lise Gonzalez is live now for us in the studio. And Brenda, you're looking at how one district monitors what the students watch on those laptops. That's right, Jadian. And teachers at the Grandview School District can't stress this enough to parents. Always check the internet history on your child's computer. Now, here you can find what sites they've been watching and when. But just like the internet is always changing, so are districts' rules. Use mainly. Inside okay. Spanish 101, Spain, students are supposed to look more at their laptop screen than the teacher. Every high schooler gets a laptop to use and take home until they graduate. You have access to anything that you would ever want to know on any given day. Kenny Rodriguez is the assistant superintendent for the district. He has kids of his own and understands what it means to hand a teenager a laptop. It's a huge responsibility. Not only because the laptops are worth more than a thousand dollars each. But uh, obviously there's a lot of information out there, uh, good, bad, and indifferent, and we want to make sure that uh, we teach them to understand the value in it. Students and parents must sign an agreement form to get a computer. They're also given a 13-page handbook with rules of what they can and can't access. It's a, a granted okay, permission, but it can be revoked There's at any no given time. IT personnel receive daily alerts if a student accesses a blocked website. Rodriguez says they haven't had to deal with any situations of illegal access just yet. That makes sense? However, just like the way students learn is constantly evolving, so is the nature of what they can find online. It's an yeah. ongoing battle. I mean, it's it's well, not one of those things that you put something in place and then think that you've got it all figured out. Um, it's constantly changing. So our Students can't access email other than the one issued by their school. They also can't access certain websites like Facebook or Netflix without teacher permission. And I'm told they are alerted and can trace which computer access these sites. Reporting live in the studio, Brenda Lise Gonzalez, 41 Action News.